Take one for WDI toilet fill valve repair. So what's the issue? The issue is when you hear a hissing noise, it's a leak, but it's not the rubber flapper. So what you want to do is clean out the fill valve. First thing I would do is to mark it with a masking tape, the line, water line, and that way I can just put it right back. So I just popped out the cap, removed the hose, and the next thing I want to do is pop up the stem. And you could just twist it around and then it's on the skinny side, it should pop right out. Next, I shall remove the bracket on the top. It's an interlocking bracket, so you want to remove this bracket. It's called a fill valve. And it has a washer in there, so just make sure it's on the same direction in that way it doesn't damage the washer. So now give it a rinse and then uh, remove any debris that is on the washer as well as the caps. Give it a wash on the inside. And if you want to make sure that there's nothing clogging within the pipe, you might just want to just uh, flush it off with a splash of water and then put back the bracket. Lock back the fill valves by turning it clockwise, put the hose back, and then just reassemble everything back, putting back the stamp, give it a twist, it locks in, and you are good to go to test it.